in this part of the exercise, boys, all I would like you to do is grab yourself a partner. One group will be a uh, free, okay, and then stand, okay, around the outside, okay, with a ball. Person with a ball now, your job, okay, on a post, there's no pressure, okay, is to dribble the ball, okay, and find different gates, okay, to travel, travel through, okay, and turn with the ball, okay, using different turns, okay, to change direction with, okay. Once you've done that, five turns, you're looking to be able to make a pass back to the person that you're working with, okay. Off you go. Try not to go to the same uh, gate that you're, or somebody else is working to. You need to make sure you're keeping your head up. A little bit quicker, boys. Shouldn't be bumping into people. Awareness of where players are, where the space is. Good. Come on. I should be hearing calling now. Call their names once you've done their five. Good. Where are you taking that touch? Good boy, Jake. Excellent. Well done. Keep it moving. Again, you should be alert, you and on your toes. The setup was again a 20 by 20 grid, five white gates, um, and this is to introduce again some turns. They were in pairs to start with, um, maybe one group of three as well, depending on the numbers. Just a little dribble with a ball, dribble up to a gate, perform a turn. Um, again, they had to do five or get to do five turns and then pass the ball back to their partner. He's our defender. So, place for a minute. If Harvey, you come out, for instance, if you got, you've got to turn in a gate, but you've got to be our blocker, yeah? So if I nick it, well, you're shielding it, which is good, okay? If he nicks it, takes a touch, okay, of the ball, doesn't tack, necessarily have to tackle you, you don't boot the ball away, okay? That's a point to you, okay? All right? Off you go, play. Good. Can you get away from that good boy? Well done. Don't pick on the same people, Jake. Careful with your tackling, try and nick it, yeah? Get a touch of the ball, that's it, you got it. Don't need to kick it away. Oh, oh, unlucky. So you need to be aware of where that blocker was. So if you had space in front, you could be able to accelerate into that nice and quick perform your turn. If you had the blocker by you, what did you have to be aware of? You just said it. You had to be, be able to scan, identify what's around you, but also most important where the ball is, okay? Turns are important because, you know, it's a, important part of the game because it obviously allows them um, to be able to change direction, maybe to dribble, to run with it, or maybe to make a pass and get away from that defender.